Hey guys, so in today's video, we're gonna show you how to replace the cabin elf air filter of a 2016 Toyota Highlander. So for this, uh, we're gonna use this uh, Puroma cabin air filter that we got from Amazon. So, uh, yep, my assistant is not here right now because she's in school, so let's get started. So, it is uh, 90 degrees outside. I got the uh, rear trunk door open. So the air is gonna come inside and circulate. First thing you gotta do is this the cabin air filter is located behind this um, glove box. So what we're gonna do first is open it up, of course. Take out all the junk that I have here. Well, it's basically not junk. Well, take all this out, and then we're gonna pop this off. Oh wow, look at that. It's a whole lot of stuff. Oh, there you go. This is the one I'm looking for. So what you need to do is, right here, wait, let me just get this thing. Zone it up. So if you will see, there's this pipe clip thingy. We're gonna pop that off. And this glove box should come off. See, there's none over there on that side. So this is the only thing. And then, here we go, there you go. We pop that off. And then, Then, then we're gonna press over here. You see that? Yep, that should come off because there's a um, kind of like um, a hole inside that, and also that one. So we're gonna pop them at the same time. They should come out. So this is supposed to be fairly easier than the Chevy Cruze. There you go. Oh. Oh. Look at that. Even fell off. There you go. And then I'm gonna show you where. So. Look at that. Just like the Chevy Cruze. This is located. Behind. That glove box. You see that box thingy. Yep, unfortunately that is where the cabin filter is. You just pop this off. Oh, here we go. I'm gonna need both. Uh, there you go. There's supposed to be clips over there. You see that? There you go. That clip. There's, there's another one over there. So it should pop out after. And then there is your cabin air filter. You see before when I changed it, I put the... Uh, um a marker that the airflow or the arrow goes up instead of down because in the chevy the arrow goes down so this one goes up so i would not forget and this one there's another clip here yep. that one just clip and it's off and voila look at that that is where the The air filter is okay. That's the best place that I can put my camera. So, one that I have has a carbon infused on it, so it would take away the smell. That's what they say. Uh -huh. Open this up. And just like the other one, you can see that there's an arrow that says airflow. So that's what we're gonna follow. Uh, 
this one out. And then slide the new one in. That's the same as it goes. Put back the cover. See? Cover even says, I don't know if you can see it. There you go. It says up with an arrow pointing up. Close this up. And reclip your my box. Make sure that's closed tight. Wait, I just want to make sure I did. Hang on. Oh. I'm a. Put back the glue box. Push it there. There you go. Put back the lock pin over here. And that's how you change your Highlander cabin air filter. Hope this helps and hope you enjoyed this video. Um, stay tuned and we're gonna make another video. Not too long. Thank you. Have a good day.